Hello everyone. Today we are going to look at how to create an idle animation uh, like this. So it's a 40 frame long animation and uh, we have tried to animate the hips, the head, the elbows, the knees and the hands to get an animation where the character looks like he is alive. So I will select these and I'll delete all the keyframes. I'm going to go to frame number one and my auto key is on. So first thing to do is we'll go to pose mode. I click on the one key to make sure that the character is leveled and in the right place. So what we'll do is we'll make sure that the character is like at an angle. And then the head is rotating in the other side, for example. Where well, their key is already there. Deleted those. Okay, so we'll start again. Then I'll simply add a key at frame number one. What we need to do is we need to go to frame number 40, but we'll do it later. So the hand here looks like Alright, so it is straight down and look from all the sides and make sure everything looks quite normal for the character. Okay. And then this one at frame number 20, the character will go down as if when you're breathing you move a little bit down. So you have this movement and then now I'll select this key, control C it and go to frame number 40 and control V it. Okay, so now we get one level of animation and then the hand, why is the hand moving? We'll control C it and then go to frame number 40 and control V it. And now hand is not moving. All right. So at frame number twenty, the character goes down. We'll do the hand. This hand goes back a little bit. You can see that the movement is very slight. Okay. And then if you feel that it is too much, you can fix it. So the hand will go down and back. So the hand is going back. Here it is front and then you can add some rotation. And it's important that you select this, control C it, go to port and control V it. So you can see that the hand is animating too much, so we reduce the movement. It's just a back and forth. The pose should right, look right from all the keys, uh, all the sides. Let's make sure that. Okay, so that looks good now. So I'll move on to the second hand. So you have to layer your animation from different body parts. So this hand will go in the front. So it is in the back. 
control C, control V, go to 20, and we'll move it in the front a little bit, and then down. Okay, and then we can add some variation if you want to rotate it a little bit. Okay, now we can also work with the fingers. So you can select the fingers, and you can see there are already keyframes making. So I will open it up, control C, frame number 40 and control V. So at 20 we can then rotate the fingers. So you get some finger animation there. Okay, and then you can do the same thing for this hand if you want. So they are maybe they are bent. Actually, they should be straight because our hands will do. Control C, Control V, the similar things. Okay, and ever slow slightly, you add the animation. Okay. So I still feel that this hand is moving too much. So it is here and then it is going back. So I'll bring it the front. So it's not too much. Okay. And because the knees are moving, the legs are moving, we will add a movement to the knee also. So simply move it a little bit, control C it, go to 40, control V it, and we'll move it ever so slightly. So move this, move it here, control C, control V. Okay. So all these movements. Just jumping. Okay, so you have to make sure that they move. And then you should, you can also work on the elbows. The elbow is inside, control C, control V, 20, and move it out a little bit. Do the same thing, move it, control C, and control V, control C, control V. So all these elements will be moving. Okay, you can see that they're moving. Is the hand getting stretched or something? Yeah. Here it looks stretchy, so we'll move it slightly up. Control C. Control C, Control V. Control C, Control V. So for some reason it was. Yeah, now it's working fine. So what the mouth is using shape key, so I'll select the mouth and then So 
Add a keyframe. Okay. Point nine. Add a keyframe. I'm hitting the I key. Point nine to point eight to nine so you have a slight movement in the eyes uh, mouth and then you can also add some go to pose mode and then add some movement to the neck so when the character is maybe slightly up Control C and Control V. Then we get an idol. Okay, so we breathe life to the character with a very slight movement. That's about it. Thank you very much.